Hi guys and welcome back. We're here with episode 15 of our Wrath of Sparta campaign and Scrim is in a sticky position with a civil war on his yeah. way. Yeah, yeah, a little bit. I'm just waiting for you to end the turn and I'll see what happens. Okay, I'll end the turn and you can see what uh, hurts. Uh, okay, it's not turned yet. Okay, I don't know if it's is turned. just doing some bad. political stuff. It's not Socrates, but it's a different guy. <laughs> oh, Socrates, an uh, apprentice. Yes. Oh, Athens has moved north. Oh, its its fleet's moved away as well. Oh, yeah, good. <laughs> I want that back. I'm going to keep my army there for a little while as well. Mm. If it doesn't turn against me, because if it does, I, I'm i going to replace that army's general with my son, or ah. my leader's son. And that will stop the uh, threat of um losing uh, losing a full stack army, because that is a very, very powerful army. My leader's army is better. Yeah. That's still a very powerful army with, like... It's also Gold. like, yeah, it's half your army gone. Like, you have two full stack armies, lose one, yeah. that's a big hit. All it's they have to do hit. is just, like, hunker down in a settlement and. Yeah, that's a fight. The good news is, if we do get to a fight, you get to play around with some pretty nifty units. Mine are good as well, but they're just not quite as good as yours. I just pump out, like, whatever happens, and I've been able to beat you time and time again with these yeah. units, so. Particularly with cavalry. I mean, it will be match to match, but you'll have a garrison force on top. Yeah. So I might have to starve them out and bring him onto the field. Oh, okay. So the Alien League just attacked me with the oh. army. I'm just going to auto-resolve it because it's really, really easy. Like, they shouldn't have done that. <laughs> I'm oh, going to release like the a... I'm gonna release the captives because it gives me the most wealth. I know is I that like a 90% success rate? Uh, uh, uh. Oh. Well, uh, you get some uh, war. Uh, uh, no, we're good. Oh, very good. And I have a predicted income of 32. In fact, if anything, it's now 54%, so that's good. Uh, right, what can we do to secure your loyalty? First of all, I'm going to replace you so you don't have an army to play with. Yeah. So, how do I replace generals? Oh, unless that's uh, Attila to a war. I'm pretty sure you can replace generals. Hmm. Don't you have, have to... Yeah, I, mm, I can't remember. Seek spouse. No. <laughs> no, that one. <laughs> Promotion. Too loyal to a political party. No, that's not going to work. I'm scared. Suicide. Oh. I can't, I can't ask him to commit suicide, apparently. That's not as... Only for the ruling party. That's uh, fine. Damn. Mm. I've got to think about this. I could try and get him killed off. I could forcefully kill him in Andros. Hmm. Yeah. And then I'd have no choice but to replace him. Okay, let's um let's secure loyalty first. Let's see where that takes us. I thought it takes always... us down to thirty six percent and the Poseidons take us down to thirty two percent. That's not done a lot. So I'm gonna I'm gonna forcefully kill him now. Hmm. I thought you could do it, but like change mm. the army. Leader, but maybe no, not. it's definitely Attila. I've played yeah. too much Attila, basically. <laughs> Unfortunately, these guys are picked top lights, so it's going to take a lot to get them killed. But I'm going to have to forcefully kill them. Oh, we're going and, to uh, the and uh, yeah, and they've That's got the fine. 66 javelinmen, 86 militia hop lights, as in men, not units. Mm. Oh, it's well, going to be difficult. I can always, if you want me to forcefully kill them, you'd always just put near a uh, skirmisher <laughs> unit, and I can just shoot it to death. Yeah. And then that's a good chance, but hey. We'll Any, see. I mean, it's definitely him, isn't it? Where have I? Yeah, it's definitely in him in control of an army. There must be a replace button somewhere. Provoke. If anyone knows where the replace button is, please put it down in the comments because it'd be very yeah, helpful. Because be nice. I, I might need it in future, in the future. Yeah, I think this is very much an Attila thing. Yeah, I think it is. I've not, uh... even, got, I've not even got kids. I've got, I could disband the entire army and no, rebuild it. No, do not risk. I'd take Andros back first if I was going to do that. Yeah, literally. I like that, though. How can I force... I'm going to have to forcefully kill him off. Hmm. Oh. I could, my current uh, leader, I can't actually make him commit suicide because his gravitas is too high. Really? <laughs> yeah. Wow. Okay, do you want me to play the AI? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I guess gonna... I will have to. That's the rules. <laughs> yeah. The rules. We're oh. going to get him killed. 
Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna literally force him into your walls into your units. Okay. Unfortunately, he's very very powerful with the best hoplites you can get in the game. So, yeah. or the DLC for that matter. So this, <laughs> if my if my tar- your entire army, there's a big issue going on. Yeah, if he he just storms through. I mean, we're back in the settlement. We were just here in the last episode. Yeah, back to Andros. Exactly. I'm looking at little huts and little gardens, looking very Ooh. nice. Oh, here we go. Right. Let's get you killed. Right. I have a mighty four units. Right. I'm looking at it now. Little moron trying to rebel against me. Yeah. Well, you probably you may not even be wanting to. It's someone else. Well, Poseidon's only at like minus 10. This guy's at like minus 40 last time I checked. I wonder if I can kill him on my own unit. Be a shame if it is to Friendly fire. be shot by his own side. Yeah. I'm gonna start it because it doesn't need doesn't need much. Yeah, I don't need planning for this. You're just gonna send just him gonna in. Be... Send him in to die. Like a lamb to the slaughter. Indeed. Alright. Night stretch you out nice and thin. I haven't even defended my uh settlement. <laughs> I've just like decided to not even deploy. Very heavy spear infantry is his name. Oh. Compared to Hoplite, which is only oh, very heavy. Medium. Mine a medium hit spear, which is not great. They're all just a very heavy. So I'm gonna I'm gonna tire him out first. Let's just speed this up. So I want yeah. him dead. I want him dead. Just kill him. Kill him good. Right. I will skirmish mode and skirmish mode, and we will start killing. Oh, you're kidding me. I told both of you to start marching. Hurry up. 27. 27. Oh, I really actually should... Um... The volley didn't even kill a single unit. I know. I realised what I need to do. Did it not? There's 10 dead. No, oh. there's already that. Thank that you. Was already I was, you've read my mind. Yeah. I'm just hoping that the general's at the front, though, so that's why... I... Yeah, why it was the other way. Originally, mm. uh, I killed one, guys. Woo! Way. Yeah, I mean garrison. Jackets. There we go. Yeah, it's just taking down that first bit of uh, like armor, and then after it's that, more, I'm more concerned that if he runs away, though, he shouldn't. I mean, I if he does, then I'll just bring my general up there. You can chase him. Yeah, you you guys are lighter anyway, so. Mm. Uh, speed us back up. <laughs> speed up. Uh, 88. One of our units has used all its oh, it's just all its ammunition. No. Yeah, it just charges the rear. Now nah, I've got uh, some archer marines I'll use first. I'm just getting them nice and close. Your units My are actually wavering. wavering. What? I might have scared your units just by existing. They broke. Oh my oh god, my the, god, the army breaking. is going to break just because of... This is ridiculous. I'm oh, sending wow. Them. I'll send them in. Send them in the rear. That is ridiculous. They've turned round. Yeah, but then... Have you got them in fo hoplite formation? I can, actually. Have well, I, I say um... don't, because I have mine in hoplite formation. Surely that will beat yours. Yeah, you're all wavering. I'm going to move oh away again. Oh god. I'm running. <laughs> Run away. Hoplite formation will keep them facing forward. Well, I, if you didn't do it, then it would be better because then I can kill you better. You know, I want. I'd rather have have not. Yeah. My God. Why are you breaking? So dumb. Is it? Ooh. Like I know we're outnumbered in that. Oh my oh, God. Oh wow. wow. That's it. That's it. Oh my God. That is How? so. What? That is so dumb. <laughs> Oh well, it has to happen another day. I'm, I hate to say it. That is just really. I don't weird. believe this. I don't <laughs> believe this. You can, you can basically just. You could have stood there for the entire like battle, probably taken no losses, and you would have like what? Because my units would have just broke. That is they just... literally broke. You know what I should have done? You should have left them in the town center with in that uh, morale circle. They keep some morale. It's true. I should have. Ah. Oh well. You weren't moving. I had to come get you. <sighs> My economy has also gone ridiculously back up. It's now to 1,600. What is this? 
It's like as bad as Wall Street. Uh, I can't assassinate him. Oh. I'm trying to find ways of killing him and I can't. Oh, it's, it's not good, is it? I He's might... humorous. What What do I need to do to make you happy? First, for power doesn't help. Traditionalist. One of those for each province where the player's culture is dominant. Not a lot of them. Patriots. Five loyalty for every army present. Well, there are no enemy army presence, so... The Poseidon isn't going to rebel anymore. They're minus one. These guys are minus 26. Excellent. I could purge them. Could purge them. Massacre of all who supports this party. Minus four influence. Minus 20 loyalty. Ooh, and minus 10 loyalty idea. for other parties. Yeah. Not a good idea. Go away. I don't believe... My guys just stared at yours. I know. Not even stared. You look in the wrong way. For most yeah. of it. Ridiculous. That's um, unreal. Yeah. It, but, by the way, has your champion... Is it your champion that, like, helps with your, um... Economy? Like, for, like, his skills? The public order. No, oh, yeah, but, like, his cost, does he, like, help with your upkeep of your units? Or is it just, um... Depends. This one does, as well as recruitment and replenishment rates. My other one, his main skill is two... Extra line of sight and discovering agents. And I can't that sort of thing. find one that helps bring down costs of units, unless there it's just really. for you. No, it's just you know they got the initial like trait, as it were. Oh, oh, that's um, so that's why I've got that one. Oh yeah, shit, I should do that. Let's do. Should we do harass? Apologies my French there. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna do that. I'll do that then because that will help with. Oh, yeah, I should have done that. I was looking at ones ahead, and I was like, oh, I should just do Quartermaster. Oh, well. Mm -hmm. I was looking at upgrade for mine. I've actually got my hero out of my army just in case they rebel, because the hero will then join them. Mm. Uh, being stuck in the army, which I don't want. So in case that happens, I'm going to get Harasser, which will basically knock out some of the units. Nice. But I must plan like I've still got them, so I'm building some farms now. Hopefully you will keep them. Yeah, I... uh. I can hope. I, can I could send them into the waters and get the general killed off that way because there's plenty of Ionian League ships coming my way. Yeah, it's possible. But then you don't want to lose the, like, actually lose an army because that could, against the fleet, that could be detrimental. Yes, it could be. You could also, like, win one battle and then another navy come in. So I'd just, like, hold on, see what happens. You might get lucky. Yeah, I mean, thirty-two percent is still quite high. It's one in three gems. Yeah. Oh, I know why. I wonder if because of my thing just going through has helped with um, Spring. Socratic method has probably helped with uh, bringing down my economy stuff. Anyway, I'm going to put the tax up now with Platoism. Excellent, right? And we're also now going to do Quartermaster for this chap. Now he now we're at seventeen hundred. Excellent. Imperium level three that apparently increases loyalty. That's all. All I go on about in like any of my game. Well, not any of my games, but in this game especially, it's just money. Where all this money, 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 money. <laughs> right now, I'm making money. I'm happy to make a deal with the Thessalian League. I will listen. And then he would still say no. How dare they? Ready for orders. I'm gonna fortify stance. I'll go into fortification and just wait and see what happens. Very strange that they're just like, nah, that, that's it. We, we're not interested. We're happy. We're yeah, still. because I've just defeated a huge, well, not huge, but it was like eight, nine units and took like no losses because there was just a garrison there. And just very, very strange. I might also start. Ooh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. It is very much decisions, decisions. I could make a dash. I don't think any of you. Oh, actually, you can reach. And you're in. Oh, you're in double time. <laughs> oh, you both is having another uh... rebellion. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. Not What's good. What's his stability now? Uh, minus nineteen. Thirteen to seven. Okay, at least put it you Right, so I'm gonna sure. send out my fleet to try and uh, take out a bit of a 
Ionian League. Yeah, I'm going to try and swing around and go for go for them that way because it might be might be more efficient. There's a f <laughs> navy. Lorien mm. is a fairly good army. It's not great. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a third army and have my. Uh, you have your son in it. Yeah, so he is a politician of Phoebe. He is a uh, resistance of foreign occupation. He can inspire and plus 10 capital battle captives. Oh. And he's five morale. He's a confident defender. My other son, who is agricultural based, is also a farmer. He's literally just a farmer in every aspect. Oh. Sorry, I just ended the turn when you were doing that. No, nah, that's fine. I'm, oh, Socrates is harassing uh, the Cyclops. Oh, dear. Sparta's uh, dealing with him. Good. Well, I I've, say dealing with him. I found a huge Athenian stack. I'm not quite sure. It quickly popped up for me, so I'm not quite sure. Oh, it's in the north. Okay, brilliant. Yeah, I saw them leave uh, one of the Macedonian settlements, Larissa, I think it was. Uh, well, I am about to attack uh, Pharsalus and their regions that they hold in the middle. So I might be able to... I'm now slowly go getting closer to supporting my northern settlements. It's still going to be a long one. Oh, I only leak of. Yeah, they're um. Got very close. I might need to pull back my fleet. I might need to build a mercenary army in the short notice. Yeah. So they take over that iron settlement. I'm gonna start losing ground again, and I'm kind of looking forward to actually putting Pushing a fight on. towards them. Yeah. yeah. Need to build some fleets uh, to fight theirs, though. Oh, okay. Rhodes has just taken Carithia in the south, which gives them a base, which is annoying. In like a day. Oh dear. Yeah. I mean, okay. It's well, it's well out of the way. I don't think we'll have a problem. And also, like Sparta will probably pick it off. It's so like out of the way that I think it would be too hard for Rhodes to defend it. He says. He says. He says in great confidence. Right. Um, I need to make sure I collect the correct member of my family. So it would be Cory Boss. I've just realized one of my armies has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven uh, missile units in it. It's because of all, all the merge oh, I did. I just had an idea. What? Build a new army. Yes. Transfer the units. Yeah. Problem solved. Yeah. I did Why think... was this not made obvious to me earlier? I did, I did, think, that just, I did think that earlier. And I was like, hmm, that would make a lot more sense. But hey, yes. Now your son can look after us. And you can go away. I am a smart person. <laughs> Inside, honestly. I Inside. Am. And yes. my son is now in charge of his army. Excellent. Ah, oh, I'm so he happy. he doesn't die. <laughs> yes. Otherwise, then you have problems. Wait a minute, why is he... Who is this? Oh, I'm a lot happier. Yeah, I can okay. do possibly adopting some people <gasps> my public order stabilized again okay let's build a new army i'm gonna have to use my son even though he's a farmer very much a farming uh yeah yeah farming enthusiast he's got literally minus 10 agricultural building construction five wealth for agriculture and another five wealth for all regions on the map so to be fair that's probably not too bad Whew. i kind of want to adopt someone but i can't Sad. Oh, it is. Yeah. Hammer of something or other. Can't pronounce it. I put him in my iron settlement, so I've got a half decent general kicking about. With it does get invaded, which at the moment is looking likely. Mm. It also means I can push my other army army north, but it's a little bit battered and bruised from attrition, so I have to leave him there now for the time being. Uh, let's see if we can build another champion, which I can't. Sadness. <laughs> Yeah, but it's all right. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to end my turn. So I think I've avoided civil war, or at least an army turning against me. Excellent, that's very good. Oh, I've had disruption in Olynthos and rebellion. Oh, there's a rebellion ready in this region. Oh yeah, there's there a is. Rebellion. I will have a rebellion in um, this province because of which province is that? Cal Calcadinki. It's just like a rebellion. Calcadinki. I have no idea how you pronounce it. That's how it's, that's how it's being done, Scrim. Um, but yeah, it's... That's like Argolos. I can't... Oh, oh it's in the north, totally. the north, the northern, the northern passage. Oh, yeah. 
That one that's been like giving me problems like f for years. <laughs> Reminds me of Oasia or yes. Yuboa or how you meant to say. Yes, yes, I'm sure it does. <laughs> we both have similar problems right now. I'm just glad that my public order stabilized. I've got another army on the way, and I won't lose Delhi. Although my navy is controlled by the disciples of Zeus, and they've only got minus four, so I'm in no trouble from them. Mm. I'm going to look at my summary. I have, oh, I have two out of two edicts. Damn. I kind of wanted to get another edict. So I could then put it on tax. I was just thinking that'd be a smart move, but I also need my current ones for like loyalty and everything else. Yeah. Uh, food. Yeah. Where are you going? And could you reach eight against that? I think I'm safe. He says again, in much <laughs> confidence. Um. I don't know. I want to move my fleet, but I also very concerned about all the Ionian League ships oh, and lying. Or I might just hold it here, use it as a base. It's like areas of base, and just keep going off to the left and the right, and just des destroying stuff if needs be. Um, I am going to. I, I don't know actually what I'm going to do. Um, I could build a hot barracks, but then there's no need. I wonder if anything Ooh. build more stuff for my economy. I just realized what I'm going to do. I'm yes. going to convert one of my enemy agents into my agent. Ah, that would help. That's a cheap it's way of also getting him to uh, to change sides. Well, to basically mm. hire a... Well, yeah, because that's the idea is I can put him into my new arm. Hmm, it's a good move. I'd love to know what his effects are. I may do. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do a jeweler. Do a, build a jeweler's, and I will end my turn. I think because I really can't move much. Like all my armies, I have four like nearly full stack armies. It's ridiculous. You can see why my economy's like sometimes gets hurt. Yeah, yeah. But hey, I need them for all my fronts that I'm Ooh. fighting on while you're dithering in the back. I'm literally just stagnated when it comes to pushing forward and it's really quite frustrating. Yeah, I'm sure. Uh, Athens is not doing very much. It's attacked in the north again and it's, I think that's also gone to fortification. So there's like two armies in the north that are just like both fortifying and they're just like we're not moving. But you're not moving either, so ha. <laughs> I think we got lucky though because in the south Sparta is dealing with the aggressors quite well and keeping them occupied. That's, that means they're not going to attack us anytime soon. Yeah. And the Ionian League has run away. Exactly what I Oh, want to they've do. decided to push forward. No, they're pushing in. Yeah, they look like they are, aren't they? And yeah. Kaidonia, who's friendly. Well, it's not friendly, but it's like neutral. It's like brought a huge army up to help. And Persia's moving stuff around now. Yeah, yeah really just, just saw that. Ionian League's fairly strong. And they are. In that they've got a lot of settlements. Very, very dear. Oh, what are we doing here? Uh, let's do Call of the Sea. No, we don't. Pirate hunting. What do we want? Call of the Sea. I, I often usually hire them because it helps with economy. Yeah, but there's more, more fleet units I can pick up. Then again, I might disband my fleet and just build a third army because... <sighs> what do I need to do? Okay, my other army I'm going to push into... I'm going to push north now because it's getting a little bit ridiculous. I'm not waiting around anymore. Can I take the public order hit? No, I really can't. How frustrating. Oh, well. You can you can survive. <laughs> ooh. <laughs> no, I can't. Not Byzantian. Ooh. Ooh. Byzantian's actually uh, starving and it's in fortification, so it's slowly going to die. <laughs> <laughs> so that will only leave... Only leave one twenty sack army, which is just Athens's. But hey, <laughs> but it also looks like it only has two missile units and a lot of hoplites. So I'm happy to deal with that. I also I've got a lot of like hoplite units. They've got a lot of militia hoplites by the looks of it and light hoplites. Excellent. It's all looking up for me. I might have to stay a few turns to sort out everything else. I can I can do that. Agent supervision. I can't do anything with my agent to recruit him, annoyingly. Let's um, get him out of my army first. Let's see what it says then. I can assassinate him. Oh, yeah. 
but it doesn't really help me. So I'm going to leave it. All right, let's look at my... Um, let's... There must be something to increase loyalty. You, you cut so, out there, man. What did you say? <laughs> I was just saying, I'm going to try and find a technology at one. Ooh, yes. I'm not sure if there is one. There. No, I'm looking. I'm not finding very much. Oh. Uh, drama increases diplomacy. Public order! Yes, we do like a bit of public order, don't we? Public order Comedy is Comedy and good. tragedy. So... That's yes. going to take nine turns That's, and eight I've, turns. I've been, down that, I've been down that road. It's helped a lot. I've, well, yeah. I've, done, I've done tragedy, and that seemed to have got me not far enough. Comedy will come in if necessary. <laughs> yeah, I wish I knew about that before, because I would have really pushed for it already. Mm. I'm going to just disband my army I just created, because oh, no, I'll leave them there, because I'll I, need a half decent general. I was going to say, I'd leave them there just in case, because the Iron League still hanging around it might be nine hanging. infantry units eight battleships they're not quite battleships <sighs> but yes. oh yeah <laughs> um should i build mm. no i can't even get mercenary units i have to be very careful that forthcoming battle okay i should be able to win it i think because the units are fairly weak yeah i found a ionian league fleet that's made up of nine transports I could quite easily take out. Have, oh, they, the... Yeah, I've yeah, seen that. It's very close to me. But yeah, they have larger fleets than they do armies, which is, makes sense because they've got a long... They've got a long distance to, like, go. Oh, yeah, yeah, but yeah. just make it seem silly. Silly. Oh, I... stop sabotaging me. <laughs> and rebellion is still imminent and it's not actually happened yet. Public orders increase, that's why. Yeah, just a little bit. But hey, I'll take that rebellion. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, my other ci like city state, well, state, state has got um, eight troops and like garrison troops and then a fleet, so it should be able to hold off anything quite nicely. It's just a matter of time. Anyway, we're going to march. Down. Bezel funds. Oh yeah, I know that's a. That's a a thing. I don't yeah, know I'm that... just looking at I'm it. There's so to... many I... intrigues you can do, but you do most. Yeah, I know. There's some some really good ones. Anyway, I'm taking fastless now. Finally. Oh. So it's now going to be a nice yellow blotch on the screen. If you all. Uh, I don't. I don't know where I'm looking. Just north of uh, your lands, basically. Ah yes. I'll be honest with you. If you're going that way, I might just move bigger army down south and just start taking over the islands because yeah. it looks like you might have the north and I need to really concentrate on the Ionian League and all that fun stuff so yeah yeah no, that's fine you, you you do that I I won't I'm not offended at all <laughs> no 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 I would it's just a bit of a waste of time if, like if you're just keeping an army there and I could probably this is not it's not the biggest of armies but it's big enough that it can deal with stuff that needs doing yeah you got a hero in there as well so he's keeping you a medal yeah I'm going to do melee attack for hoplites, and then you're going to go... I could do morale, could do that. I'm going to do authority as a leader. Then I'm going to just... Mm, I could push on. I might push on one more before I decide to start building... Um, ah, like, building see. better troops. Yeah. Because this is a good army. Uh, also, this is a horse place. It gives me better horsemen. Excellent. I sound like such a child saying that. Horses! <laughs> Give me the horses. Right. Ah, uh, I did a whole study on horses, believe it or not. I See, I, I would believe that since we've ha now heard this alpaca story. Oh, man, we got an emu that shagged. That, that what? <laughs> yeah, I said that word. Oh, yeah, man. basically, he um, he's in mating oh. an emu on site. But um, a female, I oh, know, it's a Rhea, actually. But um, he seems to take a fondness to students. Oh, that's interesting. It's very strange. He kind of just yeah. rubs against you because that's what the location. I'm using scientific yeah. terminology today in yes. his nails, <laughs> where his um, yes, his, his... in fact, no, his organ is yes. is on his belly. So oh. I'm learning stuff, but at the same time, I'm being grossed out. <laughs> yeah, nature's a beautiful thing. Huh? <laughs> uh, yep, that's one way of putting it. <laughs> <laughs> um. I will make this a polis. Make it a polis. They said. 
See the world. Oh, that's you've upgraded See the horses. world, they said. <laughs> Centre of administration, religion and trade. Then we've got a shining centre of politics, religion, trade, people. And the last one says, full of life and opportunity, the greatest city forever reinvents itself. Well, I'm going to end the turn and we'll see what happens with the Ionian League bites. <clears throat> well, if they do, their army can't reach me. And if they do, it's on forced march, which makes them very tired. Yes. So Ellis do... is... Oh, Sparta's retaking Sparta. Hey, the Finally. back on track. Oh, here we go. Byzantium has attacked, and it's got. Yeah, it's got. It's got me here. Uh, this is a battle ensuing. Are we about to have a bit of fun? Yeah, I, I've got to. This is such a big army. I've got to. Um, got to do something. Got to do something. I don't know whether to fight the battle on the battlefield or sally forth, though. My cavalry. Oh, God, they have a lot of cavalry as well, though. They don't have too many javelins. Olympus. Yeah. I'm going to hold my ground and try and hold the choke points. It Look. says here I've got a very good advantage. And I've got an Athenian. Yeah, oh, wow. exactly. You've got a huge <laughs> army. Oh, God. Huge okay. Army. You've think, got better uh, units, but I've got better veterans. And Athens has got some stuff kicking about. And I'm in control of both armies, I think. Yeah, I've got a huge battle on my hand. This is going to be like... And you've got... Oh. I, I will lose the north with this, I think. I feel this is going to be a test for me in a sense of this is quite a large army I have to, have to yeah, maintain and just like keep an eye on. Yeah. Now, I'm not sure if I have to take over control of the Athenian army, if I don't. I think the Byzantine army might be enough, to be honest, mate. I think it might be. Those militia hotplates, like with their silver chevrons, are probably nearly as good as normal hotplates now. Yeah, I'd say they're on the way. But yeah, mine are, mine, got, mine are all fairly chevroned up. Uh, this is one of my most elite armies, I think. Well, it's not. That's not true. It's got a lot of hot... Mm, actually, it's got most of my hot plates in it. I wouldn't be surprised if it is. Mm, I might have to rebuild another a fourth army somewhere else. Mind you, even if you lose those settlements in the north, make you push in for more. Yeah, I might just need to... Um, I might build a small army and try to defend the other settlement. Just out of desperation. We'll see. Oh, oh here we go. Uh, we're loading in. Uh, exactly. This... Yeah. Right. So I know where my, I know where the reinforcements. Well, yeah, I, I had a feeling. You, I... you don't. <laughs> I do not. I am clueless. I do have some half lights of my own. What inspire? For. I'm going to keep you guys all together. Let's put you on six. Uh, so seven, eight. Uh, make you a ten. Eight, seven, eight, nine. Not my usual numbering system, but that'll work. <laughs> I'm just scattering my units now to try and break <laughs> every single like choke point that's just got to be held. I was giving my hoplites, they can hold choke points, but um, it's very much a sludging match when it comes to hoplites. Yeah. Or hoplites, or however you meant to say it. Oh, yeah, it's, it's, it's going to be very, very close. Things I look at my militia, and it's just a bunch of men in togas. <laughs> I'm going to go out this way. A bunch of men in togas can do a lot of damage. Mm. With, a few, with a few pointy sticks at hand. Or in the uh, words of Total War, any honest citizen can take up the shield. That is true. This one also can be defended. Oh, where does that guy come from then? Oh, he was down here. Okay, I've now like started doing other things and I've now got distracted. I'm, oh, I'm so annoyed because this is such a good army. Hmm. Such a good army and it's going to... We're all, we're all having a bit of pain in this campaign. Yeah, it's um turning into a bit of a... A pain. I'm not saying setbacks, but we're gaining ground somewhere, and then we're losing it in other places. Yeah. We need to really both dedicate, like, our forces to one region. Yeah, that's why I think about going down south and staying there, because I think the islands are where I'm going to have to be. Mm-hmm. Fair enough. Doop-a-doop-a-doop. 
I have a feeling the um, <laughs> I know where the reinforcements are coming in. Do you? Yeah. Where do you think they're coming from? I'm not saying because I don't want them to be wrong and embarrass <laughs> myself. But I think I know where they're coming from. I think since you started here, they're coming in here. For my viewers, I think they're coming in here. Oh my god, that just put a huge red line on there. A huge red line. But uh, <laughs> yes, we'll we'll see. I might be right, I might be wrong. Put you here. At your service. Hmm. Or or they might be coming in here actually, since oh. Yes, that's a see. bit better. It's a bit better. Okay, I think I'm good to go. Oh, he's moved that now. Can you see my army? I yeah, yeah, yeah I can see your army. Oh, you can see what I'm doing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no. That's the whole whole joy of being defender. That you can, you can see. see what's going on. Yeah, yeah. I'm. Just, you can start the timer if you want. I'm just gonna. Move around some stuff quickly. Um, actually, no. Go here. Go here. I'm gonna keep my units where I put them. For those that are like, you, you now know where he is. Why wouldn't you move? Because I bet the Athenians are coming in some of the spots that he is seen. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Where from? Yeah, from the region. I thought that they might appear from. I think. Let me go back. Let me look. Yeah, I was sec. Uh, my second attempt was right of where I thought they were coming from. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Are you not going to attack until your reinforcements arrive? Are you? Oh no! Oh no! Hello. <laughs> How you doing? I I should make it back before you. I've got it. Hiya. <laughs> How you doing, buddy? <laughs> Shame for someone good. to attack you in the rear. That's no rear. That's technically the front now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do you even have any archers? Oof, that's a... Oh, that's a... In, well, do you mean missiles or just archers? Well, I know you got Jaffa, man. Everyone's All right. I, I, thought, I thought you meant, like, specifically... Or you were just being general? Well, something with pointy things on the end of a shaft. Yeah, javelins, you just said. <laughs> right, you got slingers, okay. Oh, and I've just seen like a load of Ionian Hippias arrive. The Do you do you control uh, Athens, I forgot to ask? No, I don't, actually. Oh, so I, I was thinking sending over all those cavalry first was a smart move, but hey. I mean, if you look at the uh, Athenian army, they've got quite a f it's mo mostly light hot and stuff, so I was hoping to distract you enough that you wouldn't see me charging into your cavalry, and that did No, I think you got a few, but I've got a lot more of yours. Yeah. Okay, the... The cavalry for um, Athens is just going to charge into my lines. Yeah, the AI aren't the smartest. I wish they did this just for like the whole game. <laughs> just like, yep, charging. Charging. I know they're attacking my ally. My ally's stupid enough to charge into them with cavalry. Yeah. Very strange move. But hey, I'll take it. <laughs> He's going to do it again. Here he goes. Charges in. This one's going to be a bit more successful, I imagine, because it's like hot plates. Yeah. I can, but hey, it's no units. spear versus. Oh, there's a general. They sent a the general in. They've sent their general in. Oh god. Yeah, it's a general they've sent into charge. Really? Yeah. No, their general's oh, long back. He's in picked top plates. Mercury Ionian Hippias Detos. Uh, no, oh no, wait, yeah. they're all called that. Okay, no, that isn't them. <laughs> it's just telling you which one's which, isn't it? So if you're going to do this, I'd better reinforce the line with some of these. Ready. 
I am loving the stupidity of my javelin men still. Yeah. <laughs> what are they doing? Uh, not being javelin men. Oh. Yes, this is going to make this episode a long episode, I trust, but it's going to be a good battle. You know what? It's going to be a good battle, so it's definitely going to be worth it. Mm. Oh, yeah, definitely. Right, you're going out that way. And while this is going on, I'm just... Oh, that's nice, just shooting my hot plates. How am I javelin and wavering? Because <laughs> they are out javelin. Oh, that makes sense. By a lot of stuff. This flaming shot too. How does it be lower damage? That's what I find. Um. I was going to do some flanking maneuvers. Oh, okay. How does this hoplite unit get out here? Which one? I have a hoplite unit that's like well out, like well out of position. <laughs> you saw that, hadn't you? Hmm. Oh, no, How did I? Uh... I don't actually know what you're talking about. I'm just charging into your lines currently. Oh, right, yeah, okay, I see that now. Yeah, oh, wow. I, have, I have no idea how Athens. it got I have no idea how it got out there, but it just got out there. I'm going to have to send you guys in to do that. I should probably warn you, I can see what Athens sees, so I'm very much aware where your cavalry is. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, I'm... I'm, I'm not... I'm not surprised you can't... You can see it. But, yeah, okay. Let's send in... Let's take out these guys. I, I don't expect to win, I'm just... I'm just such a hard yeah, you, you should always expect to win. Oh, not in this scenario. I've wasted... I don't know, you're doing well so far. Waste a lot of units. Although Athens has now arrived with his main army. You're gonna have a bit of trouble. Yeah. It's making for an interesting battle, put it like that. It is, it's um... It's the battle of the ages, some would say. I imagine I know where your cavalry is as well. I'm going to walk into it in a minute. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I just... Hello! I just saw nice to meet you! Would you like to see my spears? That's uh, very rude. I, I come to greet you and everything and you just run away. Yeah. It's well, very rude. I think I might win. I'm not, I'm not impressed, Pope. <laughs> I come to greet you with my cavalry. Well, we'll greet with cavalry then. Oh crap! Oh, oh! I'm feeling very tense because I'm trying to do three different battle lines. Oh no! You, uh, no, you keep shooting there. You shoot all the way back there. You shoot all them by there. Okay, it said it's general in first at Athens. Interesting move. Hello. Uh, right. Oh, and you sent in militia hot plates. Uh, yeah, I thought that would give me the advantage. Oh, 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 my cavalry. I didn't realize I lost that. Yeah, one of mine fled, but. Oh, all yours fled, though. Excellent. Mm. Now we have cavalry. Uh, superiority. Yeah, you, yeah, you do a little bit. After Athens decided that, you know, all the it cavalry just, should go into spear walls, but you know. Yeah, you just got to work we'll with what you've got. You gotta, yeah, you got to work with the allies you've got, uh, Scrim. Yeah. Unfortunately, I don't know what they're doing. They're just all piling into these one, one unit stacks. It's rather irritating. I mean, it's working for them currently. Is it? They're about to, their general's about to break. I just realise these javelin men are um, currently very useless. Mm. I'm running out of units. If I still had that extra hoplite unit that I hadn't just thrown away, mm. we might be okay. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Oh dear. What are your cavalry doing currently? 
things, Scrim. They're doing things. Well, they're going past my lines, so I'm not going to worry about them. <laughs> Certainly shouldn't be charging them and picked up lights around anyway. Can you guys? You guys are now useless, so I'm going to pull you back. You guys can make a battle line. Please make a battle line. Ah, uh, yeah. I got there just in time. Oh, yeah, I saw that. Very good. <laughs> Is it enough, it's though? It's so stressful. No, it's not, because I'm getting outflanked over here. Because this hot plate unit just keeps flipping, charging forward. <laughs> Mercenary PS are just getting thrashed here. Your orders, See your cavalry's popped up again. Riders, riders, yeah. Oh dear. Uh, I think that's your cavalry done with. Oh, I know, it's... You, I did leave my javelin there and then there for... To sacrifice. Um, yeah, that's why I'm on this side. You're, the, Byzant the Byzantine army is nearly done for, I'd say. Yeah, it's kind of... It's, it's Mercenaries, it's... not the best. They're, they're breaking. Well, yeah. I'll say they're breaking. I don't know what to make of it currently. I've spread them too thin. That's what I've done wrong. If you say so. You say you say what you say. <laughs> <laughs> Mind you, the Athenian army, I think, be the winner. Might, might work save the day. They are for my side, anyway. There's only two green units left. I ain't gonna... Is there what? Two green health unit size. Oh. Ah! You are now breaking through my rear with your general. They are. They are indeed. I've overstretched a little. Who's fleeing from the field of battle? An entire unit has perished. Yeah, my militias aren't doing too well. Ah, uh, well, you just have to live with it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and they're breaking. It seems to be a bit of a mess of just blue and yellow over here. Yeah, it's... It's not looking good. Oh, I thought I had it. I might still. No, actually, you've got to come here. You've got to retreat. My... My, my, my. I might break through here. On two fronts. Yeah, I know this... Uh, oh, I'm not going to get that front, though. Got to keep pushing forward. You've got slingers all the way at the back that have <laughs> rejoined. I've just seen that. Do I? The archers? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I've told them to retreat because they've got no ammunition. So they're, they're leaving now. A favoured tactic of mine, if the archers are finished, you send them. Because hmm. they are useless in every way, shape, or form otherwise. Oh, I've actually lost that unit, didn't realise. Ah! Missed that. Yeah, Nearly. my cavalry is done for though, so... Yeah, I've, that's why I sent in my other unit, just to finish them off. Oh, I didn't even see that. How did that unit even get there? <laughs> ah, well, we can do with what we can. Got to be vigilant. We both got to yeah. be vigilant at this point. I'm getting a bit, a bit, of, mm, not tired, but caught not very cautious. <laughs> the probably the word to go for. Mm, uh, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have. This is a lot of concentration going in here. Yeah. 
I'm, my army's slowly deplenishing, and that's the problem here. I haven't got a lot of units to play with anymore. Yeah, Your javelinmen are holding off against militia units. I know, it's ridiculous. 34, 77, 17, and your javelinmen are oh, the javelin of the way right now. Don't say that. Oh, they were doing so well. <laughs> we are losing blood. They were doing so well, and they're going to have to turn around. Oh, it's going to be a close one. It's really annoying me. Yeah, if I had that one hot potato unit, that um, I would have made a difference. I think. I think it would have made the yeah, it made a huge difference. Oh boy. Oh, my general's gone. Yep, yeah, GG. Is he gone? Is he? Yeah, he's died. Just Still died. waiting for notification for that one. I don't know if you get it. Um, I don't honest. think I do. Oh, um, yeah. You, the Athenians have just broken through. There's a flood. There's a big oh, flood. yeah. Here they come. And they're pretty full on. Oh, the enemy general's dead, though. <laughs> I got I got that one. <laughs> yeah, okay. but I don't think that's going to matter. I don't think that matters anymore, to be honest with you. Yeah. Yeah, that, that might be it. 87 versus 34. Your hot plates are gone. Put them into a wall. They're uh, slowly getting less tired, which means they'll be a little bit more effective. So that's a good. That's worked out well. So, do you put your units into hot plate walls when you attack? Uh, yeah, yeah, you should do. Yeah, oh. Because just like, just like, then a solid wall just bro charging through you. Oh, I'm just watching this flood. Yeah. Just oh, it's, I, it's, it's a slow. It's yeah, disgusting. it's slow. Is um, it depends what unit. If it's hot plates, usually yeah, but sometimes it depends. They're the exhausted as well. Yeah, though. it depends what the situation is for just generally. It's so sad to see because it's such a good army. Oh, but it's going to end so badly. And oh, I, Sorry for the, every, the viewers as well. We couldn't get like much close-ups. I can do some now quickly, but it's going to be the very end because I've just got to have to concentrate so much. Oh, I worry about close-ups. Yeah. We're all here for the glory of battle and death and watching your, oh, yeah, your army's just done. Yeah, that's it. The general's left and that's it. That's all I got. Ah, <sighs> uh, yikes! Yeah, I should have done some uh, some serious cutbacks and some. Places I'm just watching it. the last of them. Oh, yeah, there I think we go. That if I'd been able to have that separate hotplate unit, I wouldn't have had to commit my general so early, and I might be alright. I'd love uh, to see his statistics after this. Oh my god! I killed yeah. 1,800. I basically killed your army off, plus a little bit of Athens. <laughs> Jeez. My general did a lot. Those picked top lights, I'm going to take back what I said. Those picked top lights held on a lot better than my other heart. I'm now, my economy's gone to 3,800. Woo! Uh -huh. <laughs> but how the rebellions happened in the province I've just lost? Oh, my Cretan archers, archers have been pretty decent. Yeah, they were, weren't they? Unfortunately, like I say in battle, they usually tell my range units to fall back, and my artillery for that matter. Oh, my spy spent. dies as well. Sorry. You go on. No, 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 no. I was. You, no, no, no. I was just waffling. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, Byzantium now has a foothold in northern Greece. Excellent. <laughs> oh, no, they lost uh, five units in the process. Yeah. So two javelinmen, two hoplites, and a cavalryman. Yeah, I think I don't even think it's oh. worth holding the final seven. Just... Ellis wants a defensive alliance. No, I don't. You've got no provinces. Why? Yeah, oh up. yeah, they they're dead. They're they, pretty much gone now. Yeah, they're just a few fleets and stuff. And they'll slowly diminish as they've got no home settlement. The Persia is pulling out a bigger. Yeah. I'm. So... Oh, Byzantine's getting this? strong enough now that. Oh, okay, Macedon. it's attacking me down here. Is this a battle for another day? Yeah, this is another battle for another day. Um, so, thanks guys for watching. Um, hope you've enjoyed. Well, I've now got to fight another battle to the death. I don't even. I, this one's could be even harder. So uh, yeah, if you've enjoyed, please like and subscribe. And until next time, bye for now.